Why the hell are we starting all the way out here, mate? I don't know. You're the one that got us out here, dick. You're an ass. Bite me. Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play the uh, Wind Waker HD with your host, CMJ4106. I know I post this episode a little earlier than usual on this day, but uh, well, you can say a happy Thanksgiving mm -hmm. treat. And uh, wait a minute, what was that? Hang, hang on a sec. It... I'm not lifting anything. I just look angry. Look at that form. What is that? Oh god, that's his nose! And my... I shall point north, and... Stupid nose pass! Why nose pass? Why? Why are you in this game? And, oh, we see a little... This slab looks interesting. Would it happen to have something to do with this? Yep, obviously. Oh my god, 6-4. Oh, that's so complicated. Most people don't understand how that time signature works. Like this? It's basically just two, three, four measures put together. Didn't mean to insult anybody, by the way. I just don't think a lot of people understand the concept of the time signatures. I just learned the Earth God's lyric. Sweet. Oh, great, I summoned some... What the... Are you a mermaid, or... The... What are you? Obviously, it's a kind of weird fish. Outgoing hero, chosen by the Master Sword. What the hell is wrong with your voice? This is how we speak. My name is... Larudo. Good, nice name, anyway. I am Azora, Sage. For an age, I offered my prayers here in the Earth Temple, praying that the power to repel evil would ever remain within the Master Sword. Well, that's nice. And yet, unfortunately, due to Ganondorf's evil designs, the Master Sword you hold has lost it this power. Yeah, I kind of figured. Hey, that moth looks nice. Are you paying attention? Uh, to the moth? No, to me! No. Ah, little delinquent. After us defeated the hands of the Hero of Time, Gandorf was sealed away. But not for all time. He was revived. And he returned to Hyrule in a red wrath. What's a wrath? Do you mean wraith? No, I... I meant figuratively. Oh, that explains that. Just stop talking. He attacked his temple and stole my soul, knowing that he had to remove the power contained in that enchanted blade. In order to return the power to repel evil to your Master Sword... Sorry, I over -enunciated. You must find another to take my stand in this temple and ask the gods for their assistance. And how would I do that exactly? You must find the one who carries on my bloodline. The one who holds the sacred instrument. Looks like a harp with a weird face. That's not the kind of instrument I would want to have. That's too creepy. Nothing can stop the flow of time or the passing of generations. But the fate carried within my bloodline endures the ravages of all the years. It survives. Even though your species is dead? Okay. I guess it makes sense. The song you just conducted is one that will open the eyes of the new sage and awaken within that sage the melody that will carry our prayers to the gods. Another sage? I thought they were, like, just one of a kind. It's complicated. The door that blocks your way will only open when the sage plays that song. You mean I'm not a sage? May the winds of fortune blow with you. Oh my. Not those kinds of fortunes. Oh. Damn it, I hate being a virgin. These people never make any sense. Really don't. Okay, I guess I should remember that song then. Because apparently it's to find a sage. So, yes, that's Azora. Yeah. If you're wondering what, um, can you guess which species is a descendant of the Zoras? I'll give you a hint. Guess where we're going to find this instrument after we watch me play the Battle of the Gales again. Yay. It worked. We are going to Dragon Roost Island because the descendants of the Zoras are, uh, the Rito tribe. I almost forgot what they were called. Sorry, it's been a while. Give me a break. I'm doing this on Thanksgiving for crying out loud. 
It's kind of hard to think about eating. Kind of hard to be thinking about birds without thinking about eating them. Mm, speaking of which, I could go for some turkey. How about some nice turducken? Turducken? Yeah, turducken. It's delicious. Right. Do you enjoy your turducken? I'm just going to go with the old classic turkey. What about ham? I don't eat any ham. No, ham. Oh, ham. You don't want to start food, do ya? And I'm gonna walk away from that. By the way, I realized something this episode. I mentioned it in the first episode. I was playing alongside uh, Coda while he did a blind run of this game in the original quest. I'm going a bit faster than he is. <laughs> maybe it's because I'm doing 25 minutes instead of 20. Or maybe it's because it's not blind and I kind of know where I'm going. Oh god, not you again. But, uh, yeah. So, that's happening. Now, let's go to the descendants of the Zora tribe. Or the Zora race, whatever. I don't know all the exact details of how they became the descendants, but I guess you could say, like, their fins became their wings. I don't know. It's complicated to explain. I, well, that was weird. But I hear a harp. And I see a cute little girl. Oh, God, it's her again. That explains it. That ponytail. I want to... Oh, I thought you were a pony. What? Oh, me. You're okay. Of course I am. Who do you think I am? You? You're a dick. You know, Prince Kamali's been asking me all about your adventures, me. Yeah, I'm sure you've had a bunch of adventures playing that harp. No. I meant you. Okay. Well, at least they're clearing it up now. I can rest easy now that I've seen you safe and sound with my own eyes. Prince Kamali's turned to a fun young adult, hasn't he? I don't know. I haven't seen the little brat. How's he doing? Recently, he's even begun doing things on his own without my guidance. Ah, sounds like a true prince. Every conversation still ends up centered on you, though, me. Well, if he's talking to you, that would make sense. I guess. Watching Prince Kamali grow up fills me with pride. But it makes me a little sad as well. Oh, I'm sure it does. I wonder if this is how a mother feels. Uh, are you implying something? Uh, uh, no, oh, no, oh. But listen to me go on. <laughs> how weird I must sound. <laughs> You're just making this more awkward, you know. Well, I'd better continue practicing so that I can be useful around here too. Performing music like this is an important duty of an attendant. Oh, yes, because you guys definitely need musical talent. Play so elegantly. Ah! Oh, God. I almost walked right into her beak. That could have been terrible. Yeah, you're not bad. Although, you're not great. You don't have rhythm. Let me give you some rhythm! <laughs> hey! Is that the... Wind Waker? Wow! Me? Will you conduct me? How are you going to conduct yourself and play at the same time? I would imagine that would be kind of hard. Unless you had a metronome. I wonder how I'll do. Well, it is a tough time signature, but I think you can handle it. Just like that. Yeah! I've conducted the Earth God's Lyric. Play right to this, and I didn't hear you at all, because my Wind Waker is too loud. Sorry about that. Didn't think a conducting stick could be that loud. And now we have a... Romance? Hmm, what a mysterious song. It sounds so... familiar. It's almost as if something I've forgotten is trying to be... remembered. Do you happen to remember something because of that song? What the hell happened? Oh, I feel... You feel what? Faint? Oh, God! And I... drop, put her in a coma. Great. Why would you trust me for the trust fall? You shouldn't have done that. I'm me. I'm not really a good a good catch to get my drift. Right now she's hallucinating. That's helpful. How the hell am I going to wake her up if she's dreaming of this? Wow, she picked it up so quickly, I can't believe she did that. 
Now let's play it together! No rhythm! Anybody happen to recognize where that's from? And now she's acquired the tribal. Hey! What are you doing dreaming about my sword? Oh, that's even more awkward. Just. Just accept it. Oh god, she's awake! Oh shit! I better put my hand back up. Sorry about that. Just now, a sage spoke to me. She spoke so gently. I guess whispering in your ear can do that to you? Apparently. There's something... Something that I must do. What could that be? Could it be sleeping out here and getting sunburn on your feathers? Me? What are you planning on doing? Thanks to you, I've been awakened to the knowledge that I'm a... Sage of the Earth Temple. Oh, so that's... A... How did you get that training already? Uh... Through years of descendants and experience? Bullshit! There's actually something that I can do to help this world. It's incredible! Ah, I bet my teacher knew all about this. Oh, you're so sad. Come on, man up! Me, please. You must take me to the... Earth Temple. Well, you could do that right now, you know. There's this thing called, uh, flying that you can do. Try it. Sometime. Because I would love to know how. We must hurry and wake the... Power to repel evil. That seems to them the Master Sword. Yep, that sounds about right. Hey, I'm coming! Oh, great, it's your little brother. I don't like him. Can we leave? Let's go now. Quickly and quietly. Sounds like a plan! Let's go! Oh, Kamali. I just want him to remember me as a simple attendant. Good thing you want your brother to remember you as. Bye, Kamali! Hey, where did he go? Wait, I saw them here. What the? Thanks for flying me down. No problem. But now that we're here alone, we can do anything we want. Anything? Yeah, anything. <laughs> oh, I know what I want to do. <laughs> <laughs> you want to go to Headstone Island? Yeah, that sounds like a great idea. Let's just do that. Oh. What? Were you expecting something else? Uh, uh, no. Good, you shouldn't be. There's no room for that on this boat. Oh, God. Did Grandpa just talk? Uh, ignore that. Don't, don't worry about him. No, really. I heard your boat talk. Uh, that's... Sorry, I talk to myself sometimes. I like to talk in another voice. That's a bullcrap, mate. You know I talk loud and clear. I can't even understand what he's saying. Yeah, see, it's it's very hard to distinguish. Hey, that's your fault, not mine. You should learn the language of the King of Red Lines. You're the King of Hyrule, right? Ah, oh, crap! How did she know that? I'm a sage now. Oh, well, lucky you, princess. Must be great being a sage. I have to be a frickin' bot. How do you think I feel? Great. You know, I like you, kid. What about me? What about you? You're a piece of crap compared to her. She's too good for you. Well, I don't really care about that, but thank you. Ah, well, here. Now, time to explain things to you. Medley. Listen carefully to what I'm about to tell you. The temple ahead is the nest of an evil creature. The same creature that stole the life of your predecessor, the sage. It is a dark and frightening place. That is why, if you do nothing else, then at least do this. I'm ready. If me comes near you and presses the R to call you, then you'd then be silent and follow closely behind him. You're gonna be following me in? No, no, you, you don't get it, do you? And if me presses A, allow him to lift you. And if need be, fly and carry him through the air. Okay, I can carry you through the air. Not me. I'm talking about me and me. 
What? Just listen to me, boy. I'm listening to my... No, shut up. If Medley gets stuck and cannot continue in the temple, use the Wind Waker to conduct the song you learned in the Tower of the Gods. Do you understand? Oh, what? You mean that song's still useful? Okay, I can remember that, I guess. Me, protect Medley. And Medley, protect me. And as for me, we can forget about him. What do you mean, forget about me? And why am I stuck? That's because I paralyzed you with my Medusa eyes. I'll paralyze you in a moment. The power to repel evil shall surely be returned to the Master Sword. Okay. Let us bow in honor. Come on, let's go inside. You ready? You better be. That was a bit creepy. Please don't talk like that. Okay. So, you think you can play it again without me looking at you? Let's just see how good. Oh god, I almost screwed that up. <laughs> ah, I was going a little too fast for my own good. Not even I have perfect rhythm, although having perfect rhythm is really hard. Like I said, if you happen to recognize this song, if you don't, go back to episode one of this uh, LP, and you'll know what I'm talking about, hopefully. I did not expect that to blow up. Guess this is a good Thanksgiving treat, huh? We're finally going back to the main game, inside the Earth Temple. The temp I will say this. The temples after the Forsaken Fortress, second time, are pretty hard compared to the first three. Or, yeah, first three. Come on, Medley. Let's go. Fly me. Oh, God, look out! I'm fine. Yeah, I'm glad you are. Come on. Oh, it's a pretty big place. Oh, hey, look, it's a moblin. Get her. Get him. What are you doing? I'm trying to get you to kill him. What are you... Why? I can't fight then. Yeah. Well, I was trying to give you help. That's why I threw you at him. You don't get it, do you? Nope, not at all. <sighs> Why am I paired up with you? Right, you think you can make that? Uh, I don't know about- OH GOD! Why couldn't you make it? Cause I can't fly that far! Fine, stay here and I'll deal with the frickin' models. Ugh. Well, at least it won't be as lonesome as the other temples have been. At least I get some slight relief in that. Honey point! Oh, stab your honey. Yeah, there we go. There's one thing you gotta learn about moblins. They hate having their honey stabbed. Did you really just use the word honey? Yes, I did. Now, come on. Gotta figure out how to get through this door. Well, me? Ah, uh, you picked an awkward time to start talking to me. Although, at least you're close and intimate. I'm not very confident, but I think I should try to fly. I'll fly where you tell me to. Just tap A to keep me airborne. Okay. Okay, whenever you're ready, just use the Wind Waker to guide me. All right, sounds like a plan. All right, why don't I try from here? Just get in your face and do it. Uh, what's the song again? Oh, wrong way. There we go, that sounds right. <laughs> ah, see, it really has been a while. I kind of forget. Now I got it. All right, Medley, go ahead. Yay, now you can be me. I can fly. Pray for flying bird. But yeah, you can fly with Medley. It's nice and different from the statue from Temple of the Gods. Me, I'm feeling a bit more confident now. I'm not sure how high I can fly while carrying you, me, but I'll do the best that I can. Just pick me up and jump, okay? Uh, okay. Hey, Medley, could you come back here? Uh, I can't do that. Why not? You have to call me. Medley, not that kind of call. <whistles> not that kind of call either. Okay. Do, you, do I have to conduct the song? Yes. Can't you just come over here? 
Do it for formality's sake! God, learn to be a gentleman! All right, fine. Jeez, and here I thought you'd be a lot easier to use. Ah, these men just don't understand! Ah. Really need to learn to mind your manners around young ladies. Well, you're not a lady, you're a bird. I know you're confident. Listen to me! I heard you the first time. You want me to pick pick you up and then jump with you so we can fly together. Holy crap, you are listening! Oh god! Uh, uh, oh god! Oh god! Uh, uh, uh. Okay, I got it. Alright. Now, don't look at me while I can duck. Because I want to make it a little awkward. Okay. I'll just go over now, then. So if you thought that puzzle was only good for one dungeon, you were wrong. There's a reason why they made it actually a song and minorly important, because yeah. we're going to use it again. All right, come on, let's go together. All right, and don't forget, if you press ZR, come on. you can get them to follow you. Although, personally, I like carrying through doors. I was going to say, I think there might be a map near here. Oh, wait, that's where I came from, isn't it? Yeah, that's where I came from. Okay, just making sure. Kind of thought there might be something else here, but I was wrong. Okay, come on, Medley. Fortunately, Medley cannot fight. Although, you'll see that a bit later. However... Looks like she had a beam of light shooting from her. So that's minorly useful. Take that! Stupid! They blobs! Take that, you blob! Ah! Oh, look! We got new choo-choos! Mind you, I should probably be picking these up just in case. Ah! Oh, look at that! Eh, eh. There we go. Don't know exactly how that works, but that was good enough, I guess. Okay. Whoa! What the hell? What the... Ah! Whoa! Hey, hey, hey! Okay, that's a bit unfair. I can't hit him. But I did see this. Look, look that way. Please. Do this! Oh, hey, look! The light stunned them! And now I can kill them! Ah, so they're like shadow creatures, are they? The no. Alright. And while I'm at it... Oh, God, I still have seven minutes left of that forest water. Oh, wow, that dialogue really drew out the time, huh? <laughs> okay, then, why don't I switch to... Fire! Switch to even more fire! Burn the flags! Only my country flag is relevant! What country would that be? I don't know. I just thought I'd say that to sound cool. And then you failed. Thanks. Thanks for giving me the joy pendant I didn't need. Now give me the blue rupee I don't need, if you don't mind. Ha! <laughs> I threw it backwards. That worked. I'm not that impressed, you know. By the way, you want to know about Medley's other ability? If you have control of her and have her in a thing of light, press A while she's in there. She can use her special ability, which her ARP can actually reflect light. So, and she can't pick up magic. Yeah, you can... This is going to be your puzzle gimmick for the dungeon. You can also reveal treasures that are kind of hidden. And you can also pause her in that stance. Ah, my feet. Man, my boots are sparkling today. Damn. Yeah, I got a dungeon map. Oh, my. Is it too glorious? Apparently, I'm not in your way. Come on. Stop doing that. That's kind of weird. 
was shining on me for a bit, but now it wasn't. Oh! You get me out of there? Right. Sorry, I was amused. Oh! Well, that looks creepy and not threatening at all. Hmm. The two sources of light? What the? Okay, this looks like the kind of puzzle I might want to deal with next time. So, come back and we'll try out the heck is up with this stupid ugly face with suns and moons in their eyes? Get double blindness or what? How the hell did you do that? <laughs>